What's up everyone, Colby Cheese here with a little bonus video. I'm gonna be talking to you guys about the crows that you can talk to and trade your smooth and silky stones, as well as if you end up getting a petrified something, you can trade that in and you'll be able to receive some interesting random items from those trade-ins. One of the trade-ins is a really badass spear that is, some of you may know from the first Dark Souls game, that allows you to do this really cool dance. It's just a really cool dance, basically, and it also adds you attack buff to everyone around you, but it's mostly just for the dance, in my opinion. You can also get some old whips from trading these stones, and those are pretty cool for PvP. They do a lot of damage, they just break after you swing them like five times. And then, of course, you can get just various things such as upgrading stones. You can get Titanite slabs, which are very good. And as you see, I just took the the route. Well, oops, that was an accident. Uh, I took the route from things betwixt. And you just kind of run through here. I guess since I accidentally dropped down for no reason, I'm going to run back through here and go all the way back up. And this is where you will find the crow's nest. And you may have noticed this the first time through if you actually decided to do this whole tutorial area. You'll hear them, give us smooth, give us shiny, blah, blah, blah. It was a lot harder in the other Dark Souls games to figure out which items to trade because you basically had to look it up on the wiki. Now I'm going to kick that staircase down in case I want to come back here. But all you have to do is stand on this nest right here and you go to your inventory, find one of your silky stones, and notice I've got four, I'm gonna put leave, and you can only leave one at a time, and it goes, yeah, yeah, so nice, so smooth. And you just pick the item back up, and boom, that is the one that they've traded to you. This is actually much better. In the other games, you actually had to restart the game every time you dropped an item, and that was the only way to make it work. Wow, I actually got two old whips in a row. That's kind of interesting. It's not that rare, but it is more rare than getting it twice in a row. Let's see what I get here. I get a Titanite Slab! All right, now that was a good one. Sometimes you get some just completely useless items. I got some really good items there, so happy times. Titanite Slab and two old whips. That is pretty much the best I can ask for. Well, hopefully you guys get some good stuff out of trading your small stones. By the way, if you put down the small white sign soapstone, every time you, you actually uh, fulfill your duty, which all you have to do is kill a few monsters, then you receive a smooth and silky stone, and that's 